Hi there, it's Julie Kinnear of the Julie Kinnear team with Keller Williams Co-Elevation Realty and I am standing right in front of 54 Grenadier Road. This is this fabulous two-story semi with three bedrooms, two full baths, parking off the laneway and a finished basement that has a walkout. It's a great package and the best part is the location. So here we are on Grenadier Road, which is considered one of the premier streets in the neighborhood. Uh, we're, you know, right in the middle of the hood as far as, act act, you know, location and and access to Sororan Park, High Park, uh, all that good stuff. We're basically a half block from Ronsi's and a half block from Sororan. So, you know, great public transit, fabulous for kids and raising a family here. Uh, and there's people of all ages. There's people who've lived here a long, long time and then young families uh, growing. And this is a great uh, opportunity, I think, for people moving up from a condo potentially, uh, or just somebody who really wants to get into this fabulous hood. I love the uh, character starting with this front porch, you know, sitting, watching your neighbors, all that kind of stuff. There's beautiful mature trees. It stays cool in the summer. It's got air conditioning as well, so which is good, but uh, that's convenient for uh, low maintenance. And uh, you can see it's, it's just a wonderful home with the real combination of uh, charm and character from the era. Uh, the And then it's also got the updates and renovations throughout. So I'll, I'll highlight some of them. Great high ceilings here. Uh, you know, I love this newel post. Again, lots of charm and character. Uh, so you can see in the front hall, there's actually space for uh, hooks and, and, and greeting your guests. And this is actually an updated rad. So in the renovations, they put in these pretty sleek rads, which are part of the hot water boiler system, uh, but they, they're also space saving and they look great. Uh, this is, you know, the front parlor, uh, living room, and what a beautiful, wonderful, cozy spot it is. It's got this antique mantle that is in pristine condition, and a beautiful wood-burning fireplace that it roars when you got some wood and, and all that kind of stuff in it. It has a, a liner, and uh, it's all good. And again, though, there's some rads and some pretty uh, picture windows that sort of go, you know, um, looking out to the front. And one of the other benefits is we've got the pocket door. So this is kind of cool. You can see that opens and closes very easily, which they don't always do. Uh, and then of course you've got this huge dining room. So it's a really big entertainer's house and convenient if you've got kids to keep an eye on them because there's lots of open concept here. You know, even the pass through to the kitchen, very uh, workable. And this open sort of space means you can have any size of table. And uh, again, they kept the plate rail and the, and the uh, coved ceilings. And I love this exposed brick wall. Very cool, leading down to the lower level. And, uh, and then of course the kitchen, everybody wants to know about the kitchen. And again, nice high ceilings and uh, huge space. Really, really good, workable. Uh, there's sort of an island peninsula kind of thing. They have those space saving, saving rads, nice uh, maple shaker cabinets. Uh, you know, major bonus of a gas range and a built-in dishwasher. And what I love is that huge wall of pantry space, so storage. If you're a cook or a chef or whatever, or you need extra space, everybody does. It's kind of nice hidden behind. And there's even room for a table if you're entertaining guests or you've got, you know, it's always a kitchen party. This would be a great for a kitchen party or having kids or whatever. But the nice thing is, uh, you know, you can entertain indoors and out. So you walk through the mudroom here and then you go to the big party deck. And what you also get here is, uh, you know, there's a natural gas uh, gas barbecue hooked up and you, the barbecue is even included. So, and this is a nice big yard. So that's the um, single detached garage. It's oversized. It's got an electric door opener off the laneway. And uh, there's lots of possibilities for... Um, for even, you know, building another laneway house is it's very popular for income or, or extra space, working from home, building office space, whatever uh, people are doing. Um, it's pretty cool opportunity because it's, it's, it's got, lo there's lots of, there's a report showing how, how large it can be. It's pretty amazing. Uh, so I'll show you down to the lower level next. And, um, just to remind you about the location, I mean, if you don't, if you know Roncesvalles, Ronces this is in the Howard uh, Junior uh, Public School catchment, which is very popular and uh, really in demand. 
And that's a bonus because it's a really great family home. We've also got great churches, great, um, you know, uh, the hospital, St. Joseph Hospital is really nearby. So you can see in this lower level, it's been fully finished, professionally done, tons of space. You got, you know, full on home theater, desk, whatever. You got kids play area. The whole, actually the backyard and the house is very dog friendly as well. If you're a pet owner, uh, that'd be nice to have that nice fully fenced yard and this sort of, you know, it's, it's tile floor, so it's easy to sort of work. Now this isn't the prettiest out because it, we've covered it uh, for winter for, um, this is the walk out to the, ba for, to the backyard. So you actually enter through the mudroom. So there's a, uh, a way to pull up the floor uh, for a trap door and then you can walk through there. And of course, if you're using it all the time, you would get rid of the trap door and just walk straight out. Uh, but very well designed. Uh, if you wanna make it an in-law suite, it works well for a nanny suite, potential income, who knows what people would like or have um, hopes for in their family because you know, it'd be nice to um, use that and have that extra walk out. Or you know, you've got grown children and they want to have more of their own space. This is a very usable uh, laundry room slash second full bathroom. And again, it's not always used a lot, so it's kind of nice that they combined it. So they uh, very good use of space and uh, storage and, you know, furnace, wiring, all that kind of stuff. So this is a Wiesman boiler, which is a combo boiler and hot water, uh, tankless hot water tank. So the ra radiator system here, uh, hot water gas, it's very desirable. So it means that it's nice and warm and cozy and it's uh, eat what they call even heat. So it's not sort of blowing and then off and blowing and then off. Uh, so it's really a, <clears throat> very comfortable. And to, you know, if you if you wanted to cool down in the summer, they've actually also installed the ductless air conditioning system, which means you'll see at the top of the stairs. And uh, again, I love this old staircase and stuff. Beautiful newel posts, beautiful door handles, these original hardwood floors up here. They replaced them downstairs, which is kind of nice that they replaced them because when they took out the wall in the dining room, it would have made a mess. So it's kind of nice they did. And then up here, uh, they kept it, which is also a major bonus. This is like a wood lined um, linen closet. Very cool. One of the best upgrades, I think, oh, that's that air conditioner we were talking about. One of the best upgrades is this bathroom because this is the family bath because they stole this space. How cool is this? Very unusual and, uh, and smart. So you have this separate jetted tub and you have a separate shower. So that works extremely well. So again, three bedrooms. This is the third bedroom. It overlooks the backyard. Very pretty. And it's got its own closet and a good option for kids, home office, guests, what have you. So that's the shower from this end. And then we have the second bedroom. Again, really smart use of space, beautiful windows. I love the old sash windows and they've got storms on them. So that's good for, uh, you know, energy efficiency. And uh, this has multiple closets. So you've got the traditional regular closet, regular. Uh, it's nice to have a closet and bedroom. Uh, and then they put this huge built-in sort of along the wall and it includes an uh, office space. So. That is kind of neat itself. Um, and then the other side you can use for clothing or what have you. Really cool. And then the primary. So uh, here we go. And again, it's got the very pretty windows, exposed brick. It's king size. You could definitely fit, uh, you know, any size of kind of bed in here. It's really neat. And there's a second closet and there's another closet here for you. And uh, you could build in something here. Some people do in this style of home uh, and then or wardrobe or what have you. Anyway, I hope you come and check it out in person. Thank you for watching the video. There's lots more detail on the website, lovelytonohomes.com.